I'm sitting across the table from a self-made, this, this dude made kajillions of dollars, hardworking, all on his own. He earned every penny and he's a D, he's a straight shooter. I knew that, that's awesome because I'm a D and I'm a straight shooter, so I'm gonna get in five minutes. We're gonna straight shoot and I'm gonna close that deal. And I'm gonna tell him why I'm the best. So I sit down and I walk into his two, three, four, ten million dollar house and he's like, hey, you come on in, sit in my office. Sit, sit on my, sit in my two thousand dollar chair. I'd sit in it right here. Why should I hire you? He just, you know, he sits down. I'm standing like this. Why should I hire you? And I said, oh man, I've got this pitch down. I've got my shiny marketing brochure. You guys ready? Do you have your shiny, do you got your five star pitch ready for these people? You ready to, to give it to them today? Okay, so, so, I'm, I'm, so Bill, you guys started the company, $100, we grew it, we, we've got phenomenal customer service. Look, you know, these are what it, this is what everybody has to say. We use top of the line, Sherwin-Williams Payton. He goes, oh, you want some more coffee? You know, he's like, you want some more coffee? And, and he's just straight shooting and he's not, not what's, what am I doing wrong? I, I, he's a D, I'm a D, I'm getting the language right. I understand he's money motivated. I'm showing him the return on investment. He's not gonna let his, he's done well with his money as I can see. And I'm just going on and on, five star this and rating him. And here's the video of this person saying this. And he, you know, here's, my, here's my brochure, Bill. Nobody else has a brochure like this. Nobody else does what M&D painting does from the service, from the quality, from the relating to you, get, making that, sure that you feel safe. And he takes this thing and he looks at it. And the thing cost me like $2.75 per. We do 2,000 estimates a year. Like, spend a lot of money on that. And he throws it across his beautiful office. Like, this thing is crap. He's like, I want to know about some time you screwed something up and what you did about it. No one ever asked me that. So I said, shoot, okay, well, I'm a D, great. He shot straight, that's what he wants. All right, man, I painted once the wrong color on the right house. I went to the paint store to pick up the paint. They mixed it wrong, it was their fault, and I didn't check it, so that was my fault. And I came out, we put it on, it was a little too blue, and the customer didn't like it. So I went back to the paint store, because I'm a D, I don't check. I just started my crew painting it. You know, if I would have been here, I would have probably looked and saw that it was wrong. I go back, get the right paint, bring it back to the house, paint it, customer's happy. He's like, that's all right, but it's like, you got better. All right, and this, this one's true. This first one was true, this one's true. I painted the right color on the wrong house. A Little bit more of a train wreck, right? So I'm here with this customer. He goes, oh man, that's great, what did you do? So I told him what I did and we fixed it and made it right. And he goes, that's better than the wrong color. And that one's pretty good, that tickled me a little bit, he said. Tickled me a little bit.